Hi guys, good morning. I actually haven't seen any asparagus. I can tell you for myself, I love me some uh, oranges and bananas and I've seen all of those, apples, cranberries. I mean, really uh, anything you can think of. Sweet potatoes has me dreaming about some sweet potato fries this morning. Um, and really, I mean, if you ever wonder when you go to the grocery store, where does all that produce come from? Well, a lot of it comes right from here at Hunts Point Produce Market uh, in the Hunts Point section of the Bronx. And today they are going to be doing three times the daily volume when it comes to sales, uh, of course, because so many people, grocery stores, retailers, restaurants, they're all coming here to buy the produce that they're going to be selling uh, to so many people throughout the next few days ahead of Thanksgiving. With more on that, I want to bring in Philip Grant. He's the CEO here. So tell me, Philip, what's going on and how do you prepare for all of this volume? Uh, welcome to the Hunts Point Produce Market. Today we're pushing out 30 million pounds of produce. It's three times our volume. We're pushing out produce into the New York and New York City region. We're here to keep New York City fed. 90% of what's on uh, folks' plate this um, Thanksgiving will be coming right out of here from the market, except the turkey, of course. That's amazing. So for people at home, what are we looking at? What's happening here? I know there's somebody here loading a truck. We're looking at all this different produce. Explain what's happening. Yes, so the, the, the produce comes in by train and truck. We load it into our warehouse. Uh, folks come in to buy, then we load up the trucks and it goes out to the to the region. We can go as far up as Massachusetts, as far up as Maine, and as, and, and obviously feed in the uh, the 22 million people in New York. Great. New so York. as as a wholesaler, how do you prepare for today, knowing that today is your bu busiest day of the year ahead of you know Christmas time and all of that? This is the busiest day, three tons of daily volume. You said. So how do you prepare for this week and today in particular? Yeah. So we're supported by 29 merchants, and our merchants do a tremendous job on a day in day out basis to. Re really ensure that we keep the, the price of produce affordable. We're a public market, so a lot of preparation goes into this in terms of getting the produce here and getting it ready to go out to our um, to the public. Got it. And the, so the market starts 9 o'clock every night and goes till 10 in the morning. That's when everybody's sort of coming in and buying. Uh, the retailers are coming in and buying it. So how do you prepare for that? Are you up here all night or how much sleep are you getting? Uh, sometimes, I, sometimes I do. I average about four hours, but our merchants, uh, they get here at 10 o'clock at night and we rock and roll all the way until 3 p.m. the next day. We're closing tomorrow at 3 p.m. as well. And everybody's doing the, the big push now to get out their final uh, order. Great. So Dan and Hazel, our anchors, were asking me what the hot ticket item. Tell me. I said that I, you know, I love my bananas. I love my oranges. What do you find is the, you know, the produce that kind of goes the quickest? Uh, it's what we call our hardware. It's the uh, potatoes, the onions, the carrots, all the essentials to have a healthy meal for Thanksgiving. Those are the, those are some of the essentials. Healthy meal. Healthy meal. A healthy, healthy meal. Yes. Healthy meal. Produce is all about the healthy yes. meal. Yes. Yes. Okay. So I know in last week, it's so interesting you were saying that last week you guys were doing some charitable giving. So tell us about that. Yes, every, every year we do the week of giving. We kick off, we go across the boroughs to ensure that families go home with a healthy healthy meal to go home to. Amazing. That's such, yes. that's so, so important, especially at this time of the year, because Absolutely. it's really about whether you're lucky if you can have a warm Thanksgiving meal on Thursday. Isn't that right? So um, you were also telling me that this market has been around for more than 50 years, and now you're looking at sort of switching things up, uh, renovating it. Tell us about that. Yes, yes. So we've been here since 1967. We're 55 plus years old. The infrastructure is aging. In order to continue to feed New York City, we have to build a sustainable market for the future. We're working with city, state, and federal partners to build a market for the next generation to come. Amazing. Well, thank you so much for thank speaking to so us. Much. That's Philip Grant. He's the CEO of the Hunts Point uh, Produce Market here in the Hunts Point section of the Bronx. And coming up in the next hour at 8 o'clock, we're actually going to be talking to one of the businesses. Uh, it's a family-owned business. They've been around for multi-generations. Uh, and they, they're going to be telling us what they do to prepare for today. But for now, guys, I'll send it back to you. Okay. How, how heavy is that bag of carrots behind you? <laughs> Can you help them load that into the truck? How heavy is that, huh? Um, is let me big? try. Let's yeah. try. Let's try. Oh my god. I, I, I <laughs> not with one Double. hand. I cannot. All right, that's Actually, a, I can't even make a dent on it. I probably couldn't do it with both hands. That's what I need. I need that's, what, that's about the <laughs> amount of carrots I need for my family. So if you could just haul that back here. And, thank Lots you. of carrot cake. <laughs> Yeah, but those carrots oh, look good. I'm sure oh, people are going to be pounds. using those carrots to make some carrot cake. Holy. Ten five-pound bags. All right. 